what my amendment does is um, we, we heard a lot of testimony in Judiciary Committee and a number of people were saying that the reason that this amendment is so important is because uh, because it, uh, it, it, it verifies the sanctity of marriage and recognizes marriage as the, the sacrament that it is. Um, others talked about how um, it's, it's good for, it's good because we want a stable families for children and it's really important that we have a stable uh, uh, constitutional amendment that, that helps stabilize families. Um, so what my amendment will do um, is to, is to uh, make marriage um, a for life um, event. So for those that um, do decide to get married, um, man and one woman, they would be deciding to get married for life. Um, I've been married for 41 years and I want everybody else to be in the same situation. <laughs> No, I'm, I'm happily married, but in case my husband's listening. <laughs> um, but I really think it's important to, um, to verify what this amendment is all about. So, I, I, Madam Chair, I would, I would like a roll call vote on this. Um, and I'll say that first, but then I also want to add that um, we, uh, we had some questions about what would happen in the case of, an, of abuse or whatever. Well, what would happen is um, people could still separate. There's nothing in this amendment that would prohibit that. So um, we're going to recognize in our state constitution that, that marriage is, is uh, or even on the ballot, that marriage is something so important that we need it in our state constitution Then we should recognize that marriage is for life. And um, so I hope you'll support this amendment. Thank you. A roll call has been requested and a roll call has been granted. Further discussion on the A3 amendment. Senator Limmer. Thank you, Madam President. Uh, would, would the author of the amendment yield, uh, Senator Goodwin? Senator Goodwin will yield. Senator Limmer. Senator Goodwin, uh, I think this might be the same amendment you may have proposed in the Judiciary Committee. <clears throat> I'd like to ask you the same question. Uh, does this mean that uh, a man and woman would uh, would once married, they would never uh, divorce. Is that correct? Senator Goodwin. Thank you, Madam President. Absolutely, that's what it means. It means that once married, you wouldn't be able to divorce in the state of Minnesota. Um, what that does is, is, is verify that how important marriage is. It'll, it'll really make people think hard before they, before they go through with marriage and, and perhaps it'll save some children from the problems of divorce and, and the issues that are surrounded um, um, with children that, that have to struggle through a, a, a parental divorce and some children are affected for life because of that. Um, and so, yes, to answer your question, Senator Limmer, it does prevent divorce. And Madam President. Senator Limmer. And Senator Goodwin, would that mean, and, and I, uh, I agree with the general direction you may be discussing right now, but we all know that some marriages aren't as perfect as others. We do know that a woman might be married to a man who beats her or uh, perhaps a man who's a, rather a philanderer and out catting around all the time. And are you saying that you know, the proposal in your bill would, would mean that despite those difficulties, despite those events in a marriage, that this woman would not be able to divorce her husband? Senator Goodwin. Senator Limmer, yeah, that's exactly what I'm saying. But as I said, the amendment doesn't do anything to prevent people from separating, from getting out of a bad relationship. It just says that once they're married, they're married to that person for life. So in this state, they don't have the opportunity to divorce and get remarried um, once they're married in this state. So uh, yeah, um, um, no, I don't support abuse. I don't support uh, philandering. I don't support anything of the kind. But um, you know, um, like I said, perhaps people will really be very careful about um, this important um, union if they know that it's going to be um, for the rest of their lives. 